This video demonstrates fueling processes utilizing a tanker truck equipped with a Corkin PZ-10 pump with air-operated valve, AOV, a liquid controls M10 N1 meter configured with an LCR 600 register, a normal flow hose with automatic nozzle, and a high flow hose with delivery nozzle. The LCR assembly features an optical air eliminator, high capacity strainer, and two-stage diaphragm preset valve. A key advantage of the LCR 600 system is that it optimizes the fuel flow rate without operator intervention. To begin low flow delivery, often referred to as fleet fueling, the three-way diverter valve is positioned to the normal flow hose. The switch on the LCR 600 is turned to the run position. With the lever on the automatic nozzle partially depressed, low flow delivery will commence. Air is not allowed to the AOV on the pump, so the bypass valve in the pump remains open, limiting the outflow of fuel from the pump. The pump speed remains constant throughout the low flow fueling process. As the fuel flows through the meter assembly, rate of flow and gallons per minute show on the display. When the low flow fueling process is complete, the nozzle lever is released to the closed position and the flow of fuel ceases. The switch on the LCR 600 is turned to the print position and delivery ticket is printed for the customer. To begin normal flow delivery, the three-way diverter valve is positioned to the normal flow hose. The switch on the LCR 600 is turned to the run position. When the lever on the automatic nozzle is fully depressed, normal flow delivery will begin. The LCR 600 automatically and seamlessly responds by activating the AOV on the pump, closing the bypass valve, which increases the outflow rate of fuel from the pump. The increased rate of fuel flow and gallons per minute show on the display. When the fueling process is nearly complete, pressure is slowly relieved on the nozzle lever. The LCR 600 automatically deactivates the AOV on the pump, opening the bypass valve, which decreases the outflow rate of fuel from the pump. When the fueling process is complete, the nozzle lever is released to the closed position and the flow of fuel stops. The switch on the LCR 600 is turned to the print position and delivery ticket is printed for the customer. To begin express flow delivery, the three-way diverter valve is positioned to the high flow hose. The switch on the LCR 600 is turned to the run position. When the lever on the high flow nozzle is opened to the one-third position, low flow delivery will commence. Air is not allowed to the AOV on the pump, so the bypass valve in the pump remains open, limiting the outflow of fuel from the pump. As the fuel flows through the meter assembly, rate of flow and gallons per minute show on the display. When the lever on the high flow nozzle is moved to two-thirds position, normal flow delivery will commence. The LCR 600 responds by activating the AOV on the pump, closing the bypass valve, which increases the outflow rate of fuel from the pump. The increased rate of flow and gallons per minute show on the display as the fuel flows through the meter assembly. When the lever on the high flow nozzle is moved to the fully open position, express flow delivery will begin. The LCR 600 automatically responds by increasing the engine RPM, which also increases the pump speed and the outflow rate of fuel. The register display shows the corresponding increased rate of flow and gallons per minute. When the fueling process is nearly complete, the nozzle lever is returned to the two-thirds position. The LCR 600 responds by decreasing the engine RPM, which decreases the pump speed to the normal delivery rate. The display shows the corresponding decreased rate to normal flow and gallons per minute. When the fueling process is almost finished, the nozzle lever is returned to the one-third open position. The LCR 600 automatically deactivates the AOV on the pump, opening the bypass valve, decreasing the outflow rate of fuel from the pump. When the fueling process is complete, the nozzle lever is moved to the closed position and the flow of fuel ceases. The switch on the LCR 600 is turned to the print position and delivery ticket is printed for the customer. 
This completes the demonstration of the LCR 600 AOV normal and express fueling system operation. For more information on all LC meter fueling systems, products and features, as well as distributor, builder and contact information, please visit our website at lcmeter.com.